everybody, I'm Susie, Intuitive Consultant, and this is your three card reading for the week of the 3rd to the 9th of June 2018. So the first card I have pulled today is the Four of Coins. Now this card keeps popping up, okay, it came up on my page a couple of days ago, and this is all very much about your mindset. Okay, so looking at your money mindset in particular as it's a coins card. Okay, so where is your money mindset? What belief is stopping money from flowing into your life? Okay, it's important to look at this so that you can release these blockages so that you can allow more money to flow in more freely to your life. So, for example, if you believe that you have to work hard for money and you have to save money because money is hard to come by, then that's a limiting belief that is going to hold you back. We take on our beliefs from our childhood, from the people that have influence over us from a young age, like our parents, grandparents and teachers. So if they believe that you know money is hard to come by, you have to save every penny, then the likelihood is you're going to have that belief too. So that's going to damage you because you're going to be sending out to the universe, I have to work really hard for my money and the universe is going to come back with, yeah, we can prove that, you have to work really hard for money. We have to allow money to flow to us and through us to keep the energy of money flowing. So when we're sending out beliefs like we have to work really hard for money, we're stopping that natural flow of the energy of money. Okay, so what can you do? You can journal on what you think and feel about money. Okay, so when we journal, we're tapping into our subconscious mind. Okay, because we're just freely writing anything that comes up. And that's the best way to tap into the, those unconscious beliefs that you have around money so that you can reframe them into something far more positive like money flows to me quickly and easily. You know, money is an unlimited resource. Um, you know, there are so many different ways that we can reframe those, okay? Now, obviously, mindset in general is also really, really important. So, you know, making sure that you have faith in yourself, that you believe in yourself, that you're good enough, that you deserve, everything it is that you want. So this week, really do have a look at your money mindset and where it is. And look at your mindset in general, as this is really, really important in helping you to move forwards. We want money to flow freely into our lives. And in order for that to happen, we have to release all resistance, all blockages and all limiting beliefs around money so that it can flow into our lives easily and quickly okay so just journal on um you know your beliefs around money so i believe money is and um how you feel about money so i feel money is okay and that will help you to uncover some limiting beliefs when you've uncovered those limiting beliefs you need to change them to something more uh, positive so you know we quite often grow up with i can't afford that or money doesn't grow on trees well actually money does grow on trees so it's reframing that um, belief so you know beliefs take years and years and years for them to you know, really become our beliefs. So, you know, if we look back at our childhoods, uh, you know, we were told, you know, we have to go to school, we have to work hard, we have to get good grades, we have to pass our exams, um, we have to get a good job, we have to work really hard to get good pay. So, you know, that's something that we're constantly told as we're growing up. So that's really ingrained. Now we want to make things work in the opposite way. So money flows to me quickly and easily. Money is an unlimited resource. Um, I deserve money. Um, the energy of money flows to me with ease and grace. You know, whatever it is for you. And it is something that, you know, does need to be continuously repeated. Just like the old beliefs were continually repeated. Okay, so that is your first card for um, this week. So if you work really hard on your limiting beliefs... The magician is coming in to tell you that you can have anything that you really want. You just need to do the work towards that. Okay, you've got the power to start manifesting anything 
that you truly desire. You have all the tools and the resources available to you. So start studying the law of attraction and how like attracts like. You know, every thought that we have, every thought that we send out there, every feeling that we have is creating our reality. So it's time to learn how to reframe that so that we are focusing on the things that we really want, okay, not the things that we don't want. If we constantly focus on worry and fear, guess what the universe is going to provide you? Worry and fear. Okay, so this takes us back to the previous card. So not only your money mindset needs working on, but your mindset in general, so that you are you know, constantly creating the reality that you really want. And the magician comes in to remind you that, you know, the power really is in your hands to start creating life on your terms, to start creating the things that you really want in moving forwards. Okay, so this is new energy that's coming in. It's an exciting energy. You know, it's the, today as I'm recording this, it's the 1st of June, so, you know, it, we're starting a new month. We've just had the full moon. The energy is absolutely fantastic for starting to create the things that you really want. So use this new energy. Use the energy of the full moon to um, release everything that's no longer serving you. Okay, if you um, follow me on my page, you'll find the full moon cleansing ritual on there to really start removing everything that you no longer want so that you can make room for all the new exciting opportunities and possibilities and to create life on your terms and the reality that you want to lead. And our third card ties in really nicely, which is the star. Okay, so all the past difficulties are coming to an end. You now have the opportunity to start building solid foundations towards your hopes, dreams, wishes and desires. So it's time to start putting foundations in place. It's time to start taking action and working towards your dreams, hopes, wishes and desires. So what is it that you really want? What do you want to do, have, be, achieve and experience? It's time to start really planning for those. You know, it's not enough to just say, I want to be a millionaire, okay? Because, you know, spirit works, the universe works in a different way to us. Why do you want to be a millionaire? What do you want the money for? Okay, money needs purpose. So saying that you want to be a millionaire isn't enough. You need to dig deep. Why do you want it? What will you do with it? How will it make you feel? What will it allow you to experience? How will you be as a person? You know, what, what will change? So really get specific with your hopes, dreams, wishes and desires. You know, if you want to move house, get specific. Okay, where do you want it to be? You know, its location, its size. Does it have a garden? Does it have a garage? How many bedrooms? What amenities around there? Um, you know, what? how are you going to feel in this new house? What does it mean to you? What will it allow you to, to do, to experience? So start getting specific so that you can start laying the foundations to your hopes, dreams, wishes, and desires. So when we start with... The first card, okay, which was the four of coins, okay, we can start to lay the foundations because we're starting to do the work that is needed. We're changing our mindset, we're changing our money mindset. You know, we need money to experience different things, we need money to buy different things, okay, so by changing that and using the law of attraction, using your thought processes and your feelings, you can start, I get confused when I'm looking at myself, um, you can start building the solid foundations to you know, your dream life, the life that you want to create. So paying attention to these three cards, they're absolutely fantastic this week. And like I say, they tie in with the new energy of the full moon. Okay, and the beginning of the month. And we're now, you know, six months through the year. So we've got the next six months to really make a massive impact on our year. Okay, so make this the best six months of your life. Really start to do the work, okay, because this is going to have a really, really positive impact. If you can, you know, start to achieve the things that you want to achieve, if you can start living life the way that you want to live, you know, then you're on a winner. Okay, so um, fantastic week this week. Of course, if you want any help with um, 
manifesting with money mindset, um, you know, and all of those things, please don't hesitate to contact me. Also, you know, if you'd like a full reading, a full personalized reading, then please don't hesitate to contact me as well. So that's it for this week. Please do subscribe to my channel as, you know, lots of new um, things coming in so you won't miss anything. And please do come over and find me on my Facebook page as, you know, I do daily cards in there and there's lots of different things going on in there as well. So have an awesome week, everybody, and I look forward to catching up with you all again next week. Ciao for now.